uh, a new soul to take. And this one is ripe for the picking as well. Hello, mortal. Oh. I guess there is no need for introductions on. Yes, you are correct, mortal. I am a god of sorts. You're offering me to say. Are you trying to trick me in order to flay? No intention of running, huh? So, tell me, mortal. Do you fear the afterlife? Hmm. Respect and fear are two totally different things, my mortal. A chance for redemption, I say. Very well. You may rephrase what you meant. Memento more. Memento more. Do you even know what memento more means? I'm impressed, mortal. Indeed. It does stand for, remember, we must die. There's others who believe that it's remember, you must die. Or, remember you are dead. But they all basically mean the same thing. A basic general reminder that we are born, and we must die. Well, I am inclined to do so, although I am so forever a skeptic when a mortal asks me to set. For the sake of argument, as well to humor you, I will set. So, you don't fear me. However, you intend to remember me. Why? Well, when fear is off the table, I guess remembering your untimely doom would be the next option, I guess. That I will concede to. Look, there's no need to get all chummy with me. I am, again, a god of sorts. You know, reaper of what I would like to call vessels. You may call soul. The last hurrah. Any of those things ring a bell? I don't need to worry about you running. Everyone runs. What was that? You, you made a cup of tea. For me. Why? Well... It's been a while since I've had a good cup of tea. All right, then. Oh, um, black. With just a little sugar. Thank you. No, thank you. I know this seems coming odd for a deity like me, talking to a mortal like you. I just got to know. What is your rent goal? No one goal. 
You're willing to go peacefully. No fight. No resistance. No begging. What are you planning? <sighs> I knew it. No right. Dealt with that. What? What do you mean by that request? Well, you're not wrong with that say, man. It's just... Usually people beg for mercy, or ask for more time. The most annoying ones are those who mock me. These people who show no remorse for life, no enjoyment, no love, no compassion. These people who hold no way for even their own lives, that they are willing to throw away. It drives me up the wall. Apologize. It's just... There was a period of time where I had to take care of these, uh... Daredevils. Who thought they could laugh at the face of me. I know you're not. I do appreciate it. These mortals who would be willing to challenge everything. They need to have some boundaries. Don't get me wrong. There are some times that mortals look me dead in the eye and I say. I know what I'm risking. I respect you, Dad. Those mortals I do respect. Well, for starters, they realize their mortality and still push forward. To no one's inevitability and still continue to go. Make something of it. That's where I see real joy. Those who go out and do something, anything with their lives, not just squander it. Funny. That's exactly what I was going to ask you. Did you? Content with the life you live. Why? Because... Because it was your life. What are you doing? You mean, you are willing to go with me to the afterlife? No need to apologize. Natural wear and tear will make you slow. Would, would you mind making me another cup of tea first? I really am enjoying this conversation. Truthfully, you were the first person in a few decades who was willing to listen to me, even willing to come willingly. This kind of thing, I'm not used to. Hospitality. Yeah. So, would you mind one more cup, please? There are some other things I'd like to get off my chest. Thank you. Now then. <laughs>